our next uh, yes, our next item is our first uh, action item for this evening, and that's a resolution in support of National American Indian Heritage Month. Can I get a motion in support of the resolution? Go ahead, Kristen. I move that the board approve and adopt the resolution in support of National American Indian Heritage Month, November 2022. Excellent. Thank you. Can I have a second? DJ has a second. Uh, we will have a, a, a presentation on this, but first we want to read the resolution. So Kristen, if you would go ahead and read that, that would be great. Okay, wonderful. Um, and just before I get started, um, I just wanted to say that until I can pronounce the original indigenous names correctly, I am using the anglicized names for each nation named in the resolution. So thank you so much for your understanding on that. Resolution in support of National American Indian Heritage Month, November 2022. Whereas, in 1990, Congress passed and President George H.W. Bush signed into law a joint resolution designating the month of November as the first National American Indian Heritage Month, also known as Native American Indian Month. And, whereas, Poudre School District respectfully acknowledges that our school community is built on the traditional and ancestral homelands of the Arapaho, Cheyenne, and Ute nations and peoples. This area was also a site of trade, gathering, and healing for numerous other Native tribes. We are grateful that these original stewards of the land, now known as Fort Collins, are part of our community and are willing to partner with us so that we may improve. And, whereas, Native American communities face cultural and systemic barriers to an inclusive and equitable education, Poudre School District commits to close the equity and opportunity gaps for these students and promises to create and uphold equitable, inclusive, and rigorous educational opportunities, experiences, and outcomes. And, whereas, the Poudre School District Board, administration, and staff are committed to making the Poudre School District an equitable and inclusive community for all students, families, and staff, and we recognize there is more work ahead of us. Diversity, equity, and inclusion are fundamental values in Poudre School District, and we are committed to ensuring that all American Indian students, families, and staff are valued, seen, and heard. Now, therefore, the Poudre School District Board of Education does hereby proclaim the month of November 2022 Native American Month in Poudre School District and encourages staff, students, and the community to celebrate the excellence and enriching contributions made from our Native American communities of the past and present. Thank you, Kristen. Brian? Thank you. Joining us this evening to speak to National American Indian Heritage Month is PST's Diversity, Equity, and Inclusion Coordinator, Ms. Delia Mahaney. Welcome, Delia. Hello, thank you for the opportunity to introduce tonight's speakers to the resolution on National American Indian Heritage Month. Our speakers tonight are shining examples of what it means to immerse oneself in their heritage, traditions, and histories. The students bravely speaking here tonight remind me of the why of my role in PSD and the importance of teaching about the entirety of the Native American experience, past, present, and future. Tonight, speaking first will be Tommy Sue Cox, who is completing her 21st and final year as principal at Laurel Elementary in Putter School District. Tommy Sue, thank you for your friendship, your leadership, and everything you have done to affirm, amplify, elevate the voices, and elevate the voices of not just our indigenous students, but all students. After Tommy Sue speaks, I'll introduce the next speakers. Yat e shike e do shudine e shitami su kak sinishi tachitni nishle chakta nation do belagana bashishin um ah torachini dashiche cherki nation do belagana dashinella. Hello, my name is Tommy Sue Cox. I am Dine. I am from the Navajo Nation. My clan is red running into the water. And I am born for the Choctaw Nation and white people. My maternal grandfather's clan is Bitterwater, and my paternal grandmother is from the Cherokee Nation and white people. Thank you, directors of the board, Superintendent Kingsley, for considering the resolution to declare November National American Indian Heritage Month. 
Tonight, these students and I represent just a few of the over 500 Native American tribes in North America. Your acknowledgement through the resolution honors in sac the sacrifices and contributions made by our ancestors and adds value to our history and existence. We are here today because of the courage, perseverance, tolerance, and strength of our ancestors. We appreciate that you give us a voice tonight, that you see us and value us as important members of the PSD community. Thank you. Next up, we will have Chabon Dawes, Dawes from Istone Elementary. Pivotative, Nayashaviv, Spotted Horse, Na Na Tis Tis Tis. Good evening. My name is Chabon Dawes. I am Cheyenne. My Cheyenne name is Spotted Horse. I am a fourth grade student at Istone Elementary in Mrs. Smith's class. I am a nine year old and a Native American member of our community. I am a member of the Southern Cheyenne and Arapaho Nations. My ancestors occupied the land we are standing on. I am a direct descendant of Chief Black Kettle. I am the grandson of Cecil and Wilma Dawes. I am the son of Chabon and Jalen Dawes. I am the brother of Aspen Dawes. My Native American heritage is important to me because it is who I am. I love to dance and at powwows, participate in our tribal ceremonies, and show other people who we are. It is also important to me because our native language is dying, and I want to continue our traditions. I love learning about and being a part of our con culture. I love our traditional food, games, and how our native community is there for each other. I love that all of you are here to support our native voice. It means a lot to me that the Board of Education is recognizing Native American Heritage Month. It feels good that we are being acknowledged. I would like my school friends to know more about my culture and traditions. Not a lot of people know about real Native American history and the struggle our tribes have been through to still be here today. Through recognition and celebration, we can share our stories and our cultures. We are not just a piece of history. We are real people that deserve to be included, recognized, valued, and heard. We are still here. Thank you for your time and allowing me to speak here today. Aho. Our next speaker will be Najoni Norwood from Lesher Middle School. Yat e Najoni Norni Ashia, Ketnachitni Nishne, Nakalajini Bashish Chin, Nakalajini Dasha Chain, Nakalajini Dasha Nele. Hello, I am Najoni Norwood, a member of the Dene Nation. I am in the sixth grade at Lesher Junior High. I am also the 2022 to 2023 Northern Colorado Intertribal Powwow Association Princess. My mother's family is originally from the Navajo Reservation in Shiprock, New Mexico, but I was born and raised in Colorado. Our family is very involved in our Native American culture and traditions. We participate in powwows and also get invited to schools and other events to share our culture. Our Native American community also has culture night classes where we learn to make regalia and arts and crafts. We teach one another about things we know from our own tribes. I also appreciate that I learn something new every day about my people. My grandmother teaches me about my Navajo culture, including the language, and that is how I was able to introduce myself today. I am proud of the Puder School District for passing this resolution to recognize and celebrate our Native American people and proclaiming November as Native American Month. I am glad that they have made a commitment to make things more equitable for our students and families and staff. Thank you. I am grateful to be here to represent my community today. I hope that we can all treat each other with respect and value our differences. After all, like my great great grandfather said, we are all five fingered people who share one planet, so that's all along. Let's get all along. Thank you. And finally, we will have Shane Mays from Preston Middle School. Hello, my name is Shane Mays. I'm an enrolled member of the Chippewa Cree Tribe from Rocky Boy Reservation in Montana. I was born and raised here in Fort Collins, Colorado. I'm a seventh grader in middle school in Preston Middle School. I do basketball, 
and track, and I have attended I-STAR camp for two summers. I-STAR stands for Science, Technology, Arts, and Resilience. Resilience, I can't remember. That. <laughs> this camp taught me a lot about my culture, and I have made great friends at my camp. I also attended youth group every Wednesday after school called Secret Child. This group allows me to meet other Native students and talk about other issues related to school, family, or our culture. My family is involved in Native community, and my sister dance, dances in the local powwows. Thank you for having me here today.